There's a no shoes policy. No shoes policy. So I have to put on some slippers because we like to keep it clean. Okay. Yeah. Can you show me around? Yeah, of course. What, what do you like about this house? I love my grill. It felt like we were visiting somebody's house for the first time, and they were excited to show us around. So this is your room? This is my room. <laughs> wow. It's big. Yeah. Got your TV. TV, DVD. Yeah. Computer. Closet. Clothes. I have my own sheets, everything, you know? How is the bed? Comfortable? Yeah, the bed is comfortable. Sit. Yeah? Yeah. It's like a college dorm. Except it's not. This is a minimum security prison in Norway called Bolstoy, where Dardan is serving a one-year sentence for drug trafficking. I have my washing machine, my dryer, and I have my shower. Brand new. Boom. So these are heated floors. Are, these are heated floors. <laughs> you don't see that in most prisons. Oh, I know. How do you think Americans will react when they see this prison? They're going to think we're crazy here in Norway. Why? You guys have another, another view on prison. You're like really punishing these people. It's like they're animals. North Dakota has been implementing some of Norway's principles, which boasts one of the lowest recidivism rates in the world, while the United States has one of the highest rates of people cycling in and out of prison. In Norway, prisoners have keys to their own bedrooms, fully furnished living rooms and kitchens with sharp knives to cook with. There's five-star cooking classes, painting, and they even have a fully equipped recording studio. Do you feel like this is prison? Your freedom is taken from you, you know, you cannot go to the store, you cannot see your children when you want. Of course, I'm still in prison. We want them to have a normal life. We punish them by taking away their freedom, but we don't take away their life. In Norway, there's no such thing as a lifetime sentence, so they believe prison should look and feel like everyday life. The prison system isn't there to inflict pain um, and, and be punitive, but is to actually try to get that person to be a better citizen. Prison needs to be an uncomfortable situation. Inmates are in prison as a punishment. Sam Mitchum worked as a corrections officer for years, most recently at North Dakota's maximum security prison. He says adapting Norway principles to U.S. prisons won't work. Woo! Their country is not that big. They don't have the predatory instincts like the criminals here do. They don't have the gang problems. They don't have the drug problems. Norway has murderers. They have criminals, mm -hmm. drug dealers. Mm -hmm. But you don't think it can work here? I don't. I think the, the way that they were brought up there, their way of thinking, is not the way the criminal element here thinks. It's too soon to tell if the Norway changes are working to bring down North Dakota's recidivism rate. The new data won't be available until 2020 or later.